Hello everybody, I am Ivera2405 on Instagram, on Facebook, on YouTube, on TikTok, everywhere. Okay, I don't really know how to use Twitter, so let's just get into it. I have to say welcome to all my subscribers. I love you all so, so much. I keep telling you guys this on my page. You people don't even know how much I love you people. You make me so happy. Art is what gives me life and you guys love my art. I love you all. The comment, you talk about my hair, you talk about my outfits. Yeah, I really appreciate all of that. I value all of you. I went back to go check if it was still recording how it's supposed to. And I brought the camera closer a bit so you guys could see it. How about you give me a title for this? But what I called it was Us. I, I titled it Us. Because, yeah, we all feel like this somehow. And sometimes... Okay. I told you in my last video, I can't really... I, can't, I don't really start my paintings from the starting to the end because I enjoy painting nude. Like, I don't like clothes when painting, so i rather just paint inside. Then maybe when I'm done, I get to, like, dress up. Like, yeah, the finishing part, I come to, like, show you guys and stuff like that. For this piece, I I was going for a rainbow vibe. If you notice, the first is, like, red. The second one is yellow-orange. The next one is green. After green, green, blue, blue, purple, purple, pink, back to red, yellow, green. You get it yeah the first one i think that's a girl like covering his eyes like in his thoughts or whatever the second one is someone like crushing his skull this third one is someone trying to like escape the head the fourth one is someone crushing the head literally the fifth one is like two hands like closing i don't know what to call them you guys tell me what you think the sixth one is a head trying to leave a head the seventh one my brother there's a mask for one anime stuff like that and my bro called that one i don't know the other one is trying to escape this other one is stretching this other one looks like a pussy so yeah since all of these colors were just so bright and vibrant like my skirt do you guys like my skirt an auntie of mine knitted it for me she knit it i don't know if knitted is correct but she knit it yeah i'm not going to speed this video i'll just like interact with you guys i think i enjoy my long conversations with you guys much more I don't know. I think I do that. So I'll tell you a little bit more about the colors and I'll tell you a little bit more about myself. For this first one, the red part, the colors are red for the dark, like dark red or red and black if possible. For the dark parts, then for the shadow parts, then actual red, like not bright, brilliant red, the normal red. For like the clo oh god, I like my smile. For like the closer, the red part of it. Then after that, I went with brilliant red for the brighter red part of it. Then after that, I made orange, then pink. I use orange and pink for the highlights. If you notice, then yeah. I meant I'll go in order. The next one, the orange and pink I used for the previous one and little bit of the of red that remained from the first one is what i use in shading it the red is the dark part since it's an orange painting after like after red orange orange yellow yellow green green blue, like rainbow effect you get so the red is like the dark part of the painting then orange is like the okay dark like actual red is the darker part of the painting then brilliant red is the lighter shading part then orange is you get it then yellow is the bright part then yellow and white like lots of whites for the highlights part then the next one the guy stretching out of the head after the yellow and white the, the remainder like the previous colors you use for the ones that remained previously god damn it i'm like the previous colors for the ones that you used that remain previously <laughs> okay let's say the colors from the previous one you use it in the next one so what i did was to make blue like normal blue i don't know which what you think is normal blue but that blue that's close to navy blue that normal blue like i don't know i'm still calling it normal blue forgive me my colors are a bit far from me so i can't really i, I don't know how to give you guys proper descriptions right now I apologize this one i'm actually sorry okay so i used blue then yellow and blue but in a darker form like the green the green untouched green when you've not like add more yellow and blah 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 i use dark blue for like the shading the shading i use dark blue for the guy escaping the head or like the two hands like that, that place i am now yeah there 
not the down one like where i just touched that i'm sure you get it after the orange the next one by by the side of it i use dark blue for the shadow and like the hand lines all those parts then green the untouched green then any part lighter than that is a green that i mix with yellow and i keep mixing it with more yellow then you know the yellow from the other one with orange highlight that's bright yellow like the yellow and white i told you i mixed a lot then i used it for the highlight highlight then when i left there the blue that i mixed for the shading of that one i added more white to the blue then i used that blue and the green for the one under the red yes yeah, so blue green and yellow i used green like the green from this other guy is keeping the head as the shading for that one and the dark blue like and the normal blue what i'm calling normal blue i use it for like the lines the outlines then green for the shading light green for like a, a lighter part of the shading then blue for the body of the work then light blue for it after that one the next one is blue and this one that is pure blue the center one i use like damn <laughs> I use normal blue for the outline. I didn't use dark blue anywhere. Like it's just normal blue. Then I kept mixing the blue with white till I got like my highlight part. You get like you just make the blue lighter. Then the center, like the cheeks, I can guess. I can just say that is white. Let's just use white for there. Then a little bit of red touch it because of the guy that the red paint in there, like the the left hand from my view right now. A little bit of red touch it. But I liked it like that, so I didn't clean it. You know I have the power to write. <laughs> so yeah. After that one, the purple guy there. I mix red and blue. Whoa, do you guys know that there's a red and blue that you mix that will give you brownish purple? That will give you the kind of dirty lavender. Then there's another type of red and blue that you mix. They'll give you royal purple. They'll give you purple purple. But I've never gotten like purple purple purple. I don't know how to explain this for you guys. But yeah, you guys should help me. Like I need to learn how to get actual purple. Okay. But this is what I got. And I liked it too. No, don't get me wrong. I like it too. So yeah, for that one, I use dark purple purple. For... <laughs> Sorry, I make myself laugh a lot when I talk. I use purple for this. <laughs> I use purple for the shading of it. Then after that, like for the dark part, then I use light purple, like to highlight it. Then I use more of light, light purple. To like, I keep when I say light, light, I like mix more of white in the light, in the previous light you get. So I removed a little bit of pink. The one I remained from the red, the first red I did, the pink I used in shading it. And I, I don't know, I didn't put orange there. Let's just say it's pink. I used a little bit of pink. Then the blue that I remained from this guy before the purple one. Yeah, I used the blue. You notice the tones, right? You can add the blue anywhere you want because it's actually a choice. It's not supposed to be there. But I didn't want it to be basic. I like the tonal gradation. Let's be like from the blue, the blue is turning to purple. So I put a little bit of blue in the purple you get yeah and after the purple then down 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 by the by my left now the guy that his face looks like a max from an anime character do you guys watch anime why don't you tell me the character's name down there i appreciate it my bro loves anime so much and he told me before but i forgot it you guys have been seeing like one kind of anime bad enough i called him i should have done my research before coming here some i don't know i can't even pretend like i know what's going on but i'm going to watch anime very soon so drop the names for me and if you guys have names of animes you think i should watch drop it for me i love cartoons so much okay let's get let's go mm. oh my butt is covering it my father is covering it wait i have to like speed the video a bit and move to where it's visible and oh uh, Okay, for that down one, I use purple. I use red to actually shade the dark part. I use purple and pink. And I'm back there. Then, then the one after that one, the one after it is, I think, red and pink. I made that one just red and pink. Red for the dark part. Pink for the highlights. That's just what I, I, that's the best I could do for you right now. Red for the dark part. Pink for the highlights all right all right all right so yeah as for that down one that i said look like a pussy lip i just like i used all the colors i used all the colors there 
Okay, the one after the red and pink, it's actually orange. It's orange and pink I used in highlighting it. Then this last one down there below, I used all the colors and I could find on the on the surface of my canvas to make it. So what do you guys think about this my skirt? I I have to wear this skirt and this top because it, it matched the color of everything I was doing, but I swear to you I was hot. And I was on makeup. Girls here, you guys know what makeup is like. That stuff is like mud. Let me not just lie to the guys out here. That stuff feels like mud. I do like makeup. Don't get me wrong, go, but it feels like mud. If you're somewhere hot, it's going to start melting. If you notice that, like, it's, it's going to start melting and it's uncomfortable. Then this, like, I had to wear thoughts on, like, I get so pissed when people talk about my nudity. Like, how I dress and I paint. Like, I just look at these people like, are you, are you okay, okay. If you don't like what you see, just close your eyes. That's my own mentality. It's that simple. Why would you stress yourself? You get. But I dressed like this due to like the colors of what I was making. Like with the sun, I was wearing two knitted outfits. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I was uncomfortable, which was very hot. But I was way too happy with the progress of the work. And this stuff is big. This is a three feet, three feet. You all should understand. This shit is big. It's not easy. I'm a girl. I'm a fine girl. I could just choose not to get to work. But this, this, this is crazy. This is crazy. So yeah, this down one, I just like used all the colors I could get in my palette. I see me lying to myself that I have a palette. I don't really like lies, but that was a mistake. Let's just say in my canvas. In my canvas. So yeah, I went ahead and I made everything black. I felt the black was going to pop up the painting more, which it did. Trust your instinct. Like whenever you're done with the piece, when any background color you feel like using, are there monsters that paint the background first before the painting? How dare you? How dare you do that? How? I don't even want to think about it right now. All right. For let's just get into it. So black everywhere. Let's just say that's it. My birthday was nice though. For those of you who are curious, my birthday was really nice. I got lots of gifts. I spent it with someone very dear to me. Like my birthday was nice this is the first time i'm spending my birthday with somebody apart from family i really did enjoy my day i slept all through but i was happy i felt very happy usually on my birthdays i just like turn off my phone like go offline and sleep eat cake if i choose to i've never been a celebrating type so i usually just spend time indoors on my birthday i feel it's a day for me i don't owe nobody anything it's a day i can be me for me effortlessly without worry about anybody or anything you get my birthday is usually for me i'm very selfish on my birthdays but this is the first time i i spent it with someone that wasn't family and i i loved it i love my day so much i appreciate all the gifts you guys sent for me i appreciate the happy birthdays you guys took time oh, but i love my followers i love you i love all of you so 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 much i'm a lover don't play or like <laughs> don't play with me you i'm i'm a love person i love you guys so much yeah i'm a love person but extremely logical yeah, so, yeah, let's not get it twisted. Okay, so once you guys are finished painting, <laughs> let me not even act like I'm a saint, like I wash my brushes immediately, but recently I have to. I had to, like, clean my hands so I can rush and take this shit off. It was killing me. So for those of you asking, eh, for my Nigerian people, yeah, for all those are pretty cool, that when they toss and they, like, dress up, you get, this is why, it's heat. Then after all of this, I had to like make use of my gold spray paint. I don't like my stuff basic. And if you notice, there's a little bit of yellow in almost everything here. That's not enough reason though. And gold and black is bay, baby. So, oh God. I said it's bay. When did all these... Ah, all these words people use online is getting to my tongue. I'm gonna hate it. I, ah, whenever I hear somebody else say something like this, I'll be like in my head, it, this... Ah, it's cringe. And I just did it. I feel like a hippopotamus. I'm, I'm not a hypocrite. This was not intentional. It's just the next word that came up to my head. I don't like it. I'm not going to lie. Okay. 
So yeah, I spread the gold around there. And if you notice something, they keep telling me that like artists don't write their name in the center. It's draw attention from the work. Like it's just write your name by the side. Like what now? I did the work. My name is going on the brightest part of the work. So when people look at it, when they get to the brightest part of the work, they see I a Vera there. They'll be like, ah, a girl, they'll get it. Not just a girl, they'll be like, ah, so he's the artist. Oh, I'm definitely getting it. Why should I hide my name? When I know the hours, when I know the kind of knitting I wore, when I know the sun I painted this stuff in, my name is going on the center. So you guys, guess where I wrote my name? I wrote my name on the cheeks. On the cheeks of that blue stuff, on the face, the cheeks. That's where I put my name. <laughs> <laughs> I just woke up. Oh, this is like 3.29 a.m. where I am right now. And if you notice, I posted a short video of this. I've posted like the short videos of all of this. And I'm not dropping a long video for you guys. So, yeah. I decided to make a long video of it. I hope you guys enjoy this. As much as I enjoy your company. Yeah. Uh, can I go live on YouTube? I would love to interact with you guys. But that's not bad. Whoa. Can I go live on YouTube? Ooh, I would like to go live on YouTube. So this was the finished piece. I love it. Ugh, I tasted. Okay, it's not paint. It's not paint. It's the detergent on my hand after washing. I don't like spitting. It's not a part of me, but I had to. Like, it didn't really taste nice. It's, it was slappy, salty. Ew, I feel like I should cut that clip out, but I've already gone verifying recording. So apologies. Okay. So don't taste detergent. It's not nice. I don't like the taste. I don't know if other people like the taste of detergent, but I don't like the taste. So this is what the painting looks like. I told you I signed my name on the cheeks there. Okay. I don't know what to say anymore, but if you like to purchase this piece, send me a message on Ivera2405 on Instagram. Or you leave your email down below. The size is a three feet by three feet. Oh, don't mind me and the hammer. I had to like fix some stuff there. I know how to use a hammer. So after that, I got back here. The hair was just like, was disturbing a bit. I'm not really a fan of short hair, even if I do look good on short hair. But at the same time, I don't like painting with long hair. That's why I don't really show most of my painting videos. Like when I'm painting, I get to like take off everything clothes, take off my, like, I can't take off this hair. I get to take off everything clothes, like pack my hair in a very comfortable position. I was about to say, sit with my ass out and paint, but I already said it. Yeah, it is what it is. Oh, I was so happy when I finished this piece. But the heat was way too much. I was so, like, this is me happy. I was very happy, but I was more happy with the fact that I could take this off. I'm contemplating, do I take it off? Do I not take it off? This is killing me and I'm wrapping more hair to it. I don't want to die, so I unwrap it. <laughs> I unwrap the hair then. Yeah, I took off my necklace. This is a sigh of relief for me. Like, I could not wait to take off everything. If I go straight down there, I would have done it because, man, this is so uncomfortable. I look cute though. Yellow is a good color on me. What do you guys think about me and yellow? I didn't know. So I took it off. I could not even, I could not wait. I could not pretend. After this, you guys not believe I went straight to the bathroom. Oh no, that's a lie. I went to my room. I had to like clean my ground because I paint on the ground too. Then mop the floor. Oh God. Being on, ah, painting and the mopping, the detergents. Oh my God. The cleaning. Nobody tells you about that part. And I just got a new bed frame at home. I had to like paint very cautiously so I don't like stain it. Everything I have in my house is stained. I won't call it stained, it's designed because I'm what artist. I make I, I used to tell my I tell myself like it's unique. Like it's different from the ones you could find on the stores. You can because they are now designed. <coughs> Sorry about that, but yeah, my voice got a bit clogged. This is the finished piece of what the work looked like. So what's your thoughts on this? What titles do you think will go with this? Let me know.